It starts with uh, the leadership of our institutions, whether it's their board of trustees or board of directors on through our presidents and on down through the entire institution. For a number of years, I think the uh, athletics departments of the Mid-American Conference have been among the most diverse uh, of any in the country. And again, that starts with uh, leadership making some decisions on how they uh, conduct their hiring practices and, and, and go about their business. We've kind of continued to build on that and as a conference really embraced it. We put together a year ago what we believe is the first conference-wide uh, diversity and inclusion plan. And we spent about 18 months looking at this issue and it was an issue I delved into. You get all these numbers and yet no one ever seems to act on them. Someone says, well, we have, we have a problem here. We need to do something about it. Well, do we or don't we? And if we do, then let's address it. We spent some time studying it. And our conclusions were we needed to broaden the pipeline to bring a more diverse group of people into the pipeline of people who wanted to be coaches and administrators. And so we took a couple different pronged approach. One, we started an internship program across all of our campuses in the conference office where we'll have a, a diversity intern each semester. It could be in coaching, it could be in administration. It's at the school's discretion. We then started a mentorship program for our junior administrators. Again, the same type of thing, trying to coach up uh, a bunch of young administrators coming into the field, hopefully broaden their experiences and help them take the next step in their career. Now it'll be incumbent on us to stay in touch, have a good alumni association, in essence, track them, and use that database that as jobs open, we encourage our people or others to uh, look to that database as people who might uh, be qualified. We're already partnering up with the Big Ten who's doing some similar things and doing some sharing of databases and so on. So again, we can work collaboratively and again, hopefully broaden that pipeline of people coming into the industry.